Mu riding a seven-game win streak into a weekend set with the first half champion Casper Spuds. Game one on Saturday, top of the first scoreless, and Josh Phillips shows why the Spuds have been so good this year. The 1-0. Phillips rips this ball toward right field. Yetter comes on and it bounces in front of him and rolls all the way to the fence. And it goes under the fence. And it is going to be, let's see what they're going to award here. They're going to award a double. Top three, four nothing. Casper leads and the Spuds get yet another big outfield hit. 2-0. Swung on and ripped to right field. This one's deep and it is going to one hop the fence. Phillips around third. He will trot home. Jackson will stroll into second base. RBI double. 5 nothing in favor of the Spuds. Meanwhile, the Moo had no success against right-hander Hayden Mullins, who would end up going eight and a third innings. Next pitch. Fastball called strike three at the knees to end the inning. So Hayden Mullins gets another strikeout. His sixth. A few innings with no scoring, but the Spuds got back on the scoreboard in the eighth. Nine nothing now, and Casper keeps on piling on runs. Final game of the series tomorrow. Pitch to Jackson, bounces it over the mound. Espinosa's got it. He will fire it over to first base, and it's in time for out number two as a run scores. Now ten nothing, Casper. And the cherry on top for the Spuds would come in the top of the nine. Spuds now up eleven nothing, and they're not done. Next pitch. Swung on and popped in the air to right. Yetter took a step in. Now floats back. Makes the catch. And now we'll toss it in. Scoring from third on the play will be Henderson to make it 12-0. It was better late than never for the Fremont offense, though, who would finally score in the bottom of the ninth. 12-2 ball game now. Next pitch. Swung on and hit in the left field. Base hit. Carson Burnett with an RBI single. Makes it now 12-3. to three. But Lorenzo Bailey would get the final out as Casper wins another. Also an air. This pitch swung on, hit to right. Jackson coming on. He'll make the catch, and that's the ball game. So the Casper Spuds defeat the Fremont Moo tonight. My final score of 12-3. to three. The Spuds have won their 12th in a row. And Casper ha or Fremont has its seven-game winning streak come to a close. Move all 12-3. They try to salvage a series split Sunday at 5.05 p.m. from a store at Molar Field.